Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Cliff with Pink Flamingo Power Wash. I'm back with a brand new video for you guys. Today we're working in Tampa, Florida. We're here for a commercial job. It's a cabinet cabinet shop, uh, granite cabinet shop that's about to open right here and um, right off of Waters Avenue. Um, pretty, pretty busy street. It's actually right next to a Lowe's. <laughs> so um, yeah, man, they called me two days ago. They asked me to get this set up. Um, just gonna just be doing some surface cleaning and cleaning the front of the building. Uh, not much to it. Actually, this next door, they have a T-Mobile and a nail spa. I'm gonna leave it in my card. Hopefully they call me up because it's gonna look crazy when I'm done. Uh, if you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Make sure you like and leave a comment. And if you got any questions, go ahead and drop him, you know what I'm saying, in the comments. Uh, with that said, man, also I got a, uh, the giveaway and the, uh, the link for the giveaway in the description. We almost at 8,000. I think we need um, 25 more to hit 8,000 subscribers. Where somebody's gonna win, first place is gonna win a pair of hot boots, second place is gonna win a pressure washing gun, and third place is gonna win a pink flamingo t shirt. And like I tell you guys, you don't have to be a pressure washing company to use this stuff. If uh, if you don't wanna use it yourself, you know, you can always pass it, pass it to somebody else that can use it. So let me show you guys what we got going on. All right, so this is the plaza here. Uh, got Office Depot over here, got uh, Target down there, and Lowe's is literally right there. So this is the cabinet shop we're doing. It's gonna open soon, it got some algae on it, uh, underneath the uh, the signs. Um, but mostly it's gonna be a lot of surface cleaning, getting this cleaned up. They were supposed to have a guy here to remove all this trash so I could clean all this area, but the guy is not here and I gotta get going. So I'm gonna clean all this up. Also, they gotta get all this um, gravel, whatever this is over here up too. Well, you see the windows are pretty dirty. It's like it's not open yet. It's like they're gonna be doing some remodeling and stuff in there. But um, shouldn't be too hard to do. Just a lot of dust and, and dirt. Not so much a lot of algae up top over here. But we're gonna clean all the way up to this section here. Yeah, to that way. So when these people get here, this, whenever they open, they'll see the difference. All right, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and get started. We'll go ahead and wet down the windows first with some water. Uh, they don't have water up front, but they do have water in the back. So I already got a full tank. So I'm gonna start with that. That should give me about a good 20 minutes or so working with my tank. Yeah, whatever is left, I just go back and just refill up. that we soaked up we're gonna let that dwell come back and give it a good rinse the window will get cleaned up because I got a good surfactant on there everything should be rinsing up really good should be nice and shiny see all that dirt on there and get all that cleaned up
got the entrance um, surface clean. Got some lines. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go the opposite way right quick, just to blend it in. And I'm gonna full street this to make it pop a little bit more. Well, look who's on food up for me. Hey, Aquanomics I, I, Power Wash. I wanna, I wanna, what up, man? It's good, bro. Yeah, I just got done doing it. I just got a, a surface um, full street it. I may go over it one more time though. Just yeah, making over here got that rust, right? But that's not part of pressure washing. I mean, this was nasty earlier. You see the difference between this side here and that side. Hopefully, T-Mobile calls me. Huh? I just got done doing the cleaning this way. Got a little bit of line still, but we're gonna post treat those and it'll go away. Looking pretty good. Take a look, man. We all finished. This is the final product. I got the post treatment on there. As you can tell, the lines went away pretty much. I mean, this is a commercial job and high foot traffic. There's nothing we can really do. You can see this side, what this side looks like compared to that. Night and day, man. Windows are clean. Underneath right here is washed up also. I don't know if somebody gotta move that. Hopefully they call me back. That's gonna be another charge for me to come out and clean that spot where the, uh, where the trash is. I had to go around it, but um, yes, sir. We got one more job on the schedule. We're gonna be doing a, a metal roof cleaning. So I see you guys when I get there. All right, before we go to the next stop to clean that roof, we're gonna go ahead and get some chlorine. You see the tent behind me, I'm at Pinch of Penny. Um, I got about, 50 gallons of, um, not 50 gallons, I got about 30 gallons. So I'm gonna get like 20, 20 more, maybe 25 more. I don't like to fill my SH all the way to the top. Give it a little room so when the fumes come out, they go through the fume hose, go through the bottom of the van. Started right, right there, that's about halfway. Is this thing even on? <laughs> Make sure it's on, so I'm not just sitting out here. Oh yeah, we on. All right, you guys, man. I'm gonna shut down for the day, cause a lot of rain, man. We had a little storm come through, and um, we still getting a lot of rain down here in Tampa. Uh, so I'm gonna take this opportunity to go and do a couple of the estimates. I got a call from uh, two dealerships down here uh, that I have to quote. I actually went and quoted them about two days ago at like 6 a.m. Um, and it was still dark outside because of the time change. So I want to go back and just double check and make sure, you know what I'm saying? What I saw when it was dark is still there and things that I didn't see. So I want to make sure I get a good estimate uh, for these people. So um, yeah, man, I, I'll go in that description. We're almost at, at 8K, 8,000 subscribers. We're like 25 subscribers away. Make sure you tell people about the channel, man. If you like pressure washing content, you know, like to see satisfying cleaning and learning new stuff, make sure you all uh, share the video to your family and friends. So I appreciate y'all. I appreciate all y'all subscribers from the beginning that I've had since we only had like 100 people. And it's crazy. I'm almost at 8,000 subscribers. So I'm going to see y'all in the next video. Peace.